for the bottom squat lift. What we're gonna do here, our goal is to get awareness on our core, lengthening the hamstrings and also strengthening them, and then really getting the quads to light up a bit and feeling if we have a difference. And if you video this from a side or a back angle, kind of like you'd be looking through at the camera in a second, you'll be able to see if you're shifting as well. But step number one, you stand in your squat with, but for the case of this exercise, I want you to have your toes straight forward. From here, I'm going to bend my knees as much as I need, but I'll fold forward to get my hands flat to the ground. So I have to bend my knees to about here. I can't be fully straight because my hands will lift up. From there, I will glue my chest to my thighs by flexing my core. So I flex my core, flex my core. My chest is glued to my legs here. From there, I will drop down into the squat and I will prevent my arch from collapsing, my feet from spinning out, or anything like that. And then if I can go higher, I lift my chest. Maybe I can't get to this position. Maybe I can only lower down to here. That's totally fine. I can still try and lift my chest without my core coming off my legs. Now let's say I get to this bottom position here. I'm gonna have you hold it for a certain period of time. I'll cue you to, um, what to do. Right now the front of my shins, my hips, they're all getting lit up. I can see my hips and my feet, so I will fix if there is any shift. Then what I will do is while constantly bracing my core, gluing my chest to my thighs, I will begin to straighten the legs. And I do not let my chest go away. And the more I keep this position active, I feel my quads burning, I feel my hamstrings burning and getting a stretch, and I really feel my core almost to the point where it's gonna cramp because I'm trying to brace so hard. I hold here, and then again, I start to drop back down, okay? If I can lift the chest, I lift the chest. Nothing is changing at the feet. Toes are down, arch is good, feet aren't spinning. Hands down, chest is still glued to the legs. And that's gonna be the squat, uh, bottom squat lift that we'll go back and forth through.